Andreas Freer uh, visualizing again the philosophy of uh, Jakob Böhme. Um, I can't go into um, every detail. I'll just open up um, these various beautiful little flaps. But if if yes. you're free to comment on uh, well, uh, what I must add to begin with yeah. is that. Until I saw this actual manuscript, mm -hmm. I believe these were separate illustrations, so I didn't realise they ah. fold out like this. Yes, so they do. We've seen pictures. Uh, I haven't seen that one. Fine. And of these together. Tincture, that's our chemical. Because uh, he was also indebted to Paracelsus, of course. Mm -hmm. Bermin is As are we all? Majesty. I love yeah. the detail <laughs> of this. And of course, the uh, the source is yod heh vav -he. The ineffable name is God. That's the of first course. table. Yeah. And there are three of these, and it's all about regeneration and man and, and woman. Yeah. Um, you know, the, the idea is to... In, let's go to the... from This is it's all badness, oh. thistles and thorns oh. and zodiac. But in the third table... It's interesting to see this regenerated man. So he stands amongst the zodiac. We have the beautiful roses and uh, wonderful flowers here, are where we used to have thistles mm -hmm. and so on. And we can see the planets are divine within him. And in his heart, he has the dove, so he's got the Holy Spirit. He's got the peacock here in his right breast. We can see Mars in his throat. And I think... Uh, Jupiter, as he got in his awareness. Yes. So, um, that's a regenerated man. And you've got the Garden of Eden. Freya also provided explanations to um, these wonderful tables, which, by the way, will feature in a major exhibition which we're planning uh, at the end of next year in December to open here uh, on Jakob Böhme. Um, an exhibition that was first shown uh, in Dresden and will travel uh, to Amsterdam, but we're going to add a special uh, Amsterdam component because it was here in Amsterdam that Burma's works were first published. You know, he, he was under a publishing ban. He was not allowed to publish his own works uh, at home in Görlitz. Um, and so that's going to be a, a wonderful exhibition. So that's at the end of 2019. Yes, yes. December 2019. Wonderful. Yeah. <laughs>